Hi there and welcome to the channel. Today we're going to be making a great family favourite. We're going for spaghetti bolognese. Now this is something that everybody generally loves. It's quick and easy to make and also if you make it in large quantities you're able to batch cook it and um, you've got some left over to freeze for a later date which is which is really handy. Before I crack on don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell uh, to look out for more videos coming soon. So to start with, uh, chop the carrots into small pieces. Then chop up, or finely chop uh, two mushrooms. You can do more if you want. One large onion. I'm using 500 grams of uh, beef mince. Pop a little bit of oil in the pan and then get your onions in. You can add garlic now if you've got some. I didn't actually have any, I only had garlic puree, puree so um, get, the, get the beef in. It's all nicely brown. And the salt and pepper. Pop the carrot and the mushroom into the pan. Now, I'm adding one oxo cube, beef oxo cube. Crush that up. And some Worcestershire short sauce. You can put, you put as much as you like in. Two cans of plum tomatoes. You can do chopped tomatoes, whatever. Or, or. A tablespoon of um, oregano some tomato puree and some garlic puree. Stir it in nicely. Now, I'm putting half a, a can of water in, uh, but you could put a whole can in. And there's some brown sugar going in just to add some, some uh, sweetness. Pop the spaghetti in and cook for about an hour. Reduce it down. Once the spaghetti's done, put it on the plate and add the, the bolognese. Any leftover bolognese can be frozen and saved for another day. And finally, to top it off, add some grated Parmesan cheese. There you go, spaghetti bolognese. Most people like it, it's a great dish. Definitely worth a go. You can always add some red wine as well to give it uh, extra flavor. Um, also, if you're cooking it at the weekend, once the liquid starts reducing down, add maybe uh, a tin of water uh, and reduce that down and maybe do that a couple of times because the longer you cook it, the better the flavor. And that's, that's definite. Anyway, thanks so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, click the like. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell to look out for more videos coming soon.